certified hood classic. Fellas, I'm going to go solo today because there's something I need to discuss. Now, I know a lot of y'all want me to talk about the game. You know what I'm saying? You guys will get that coming right up. But what is going on with y'all's man? You guys know who I'm talking about. Can we see the clip? Bruh. That's it. Drake, it is time to go to therapy. It is officially time to go to therapy because you got the barrettes in your head. Only Snoop Dogg could rock Barrett's, but dude, you look like, you look like a light-skinned popsicle. You and Jimmy Butler got that issue with y'all's head. It's either nappy or basically just the wrong hairstyle. Drake, who are you? Like, Kendrick Lamar was right. You've been crashing on ever since you lost uh, Rihanna. Then Nikki. Then Megan, and then of course you lost the battle to Kendrick in front of the whole wide world. Aubrey, it is time to go to therapy. Get some counsel because this ain't it. Brother, this is not it. What do you some nerky say? The brother needs help. Yeah, that, that's right, that's right. <laughs> Drake. I'm actually going to need to wash my eyes out with bleach. Because you got them big ass clips in your head. This these this is not the 90s, sadly. If you're trying to channel that. You look like um you look like that one messy baby mama with a bunch of kids basically um throwing her ass out on dudes. I used to be a crash out myself back in the day. You know what I'm saying? I used to try these different clothes, hairstyles, and stuff. I used to be just like Aubrey. I had an identity crisis myself. Because I was in love with this one girl who's really, really beautiful, same age as me. I used to do the duck lips. I used to do everything to try and please this little girl. But it it it, it got me reported so many times. And I did it again um, shortly after um, I graduated high school. It was with a different girl. You know what I'm saying? That one year, I even tried to uh, dress up as Urkel as Halloween. But, you know, good thing I didn't get clowned for that. You know what I'm saying? Because if 2024 was like 2018, I wouldn't be able to leave the house. You know what I'm saying? But anywho, um, I don't feel embarrassed about dressing up as Urkel that one year. But I was able to get myself back together, get some normal ass clothes, normal ass hairstyle, and fit with my brand and then grow my brand. I even tried to do the Urkel man. You know what I'm saying? Basically, that whole dance. I was a crash out. You know what I'm saying? A D1 crash out back in the day. You know what I'm saying? I admit it. Yeah, I admit it. Draco Thompson was a crash out himself behind closed doors. I admit it. But I would never, ever crash out over not getting the kitty cat. Over not getting some poo. The poo. I would never crash out over that. You see here? Here, the big 2019. Where I was first introduced. I was able to fit out my wardrobe. Get some glasses, a hat, and basically a clean baby face. You know what I'm saying? I had waves back in the day. Drake, you need to go back to the waves. You know what I'm saying? Just go back to the waves. You know what I'm saying? Um, by the way, I did have braces back then, so. But anyways, that's besides the point. Back to Drake. Back to Drake. Back to Drake. Back to Drake. Because some ain't adding up. Yes, I had the heart in my head as well. But I ended up stopped doing that after two times because Drake, you have so many boys idolizing you. I don't even know if you're an R&B singer, 
a rapper, or a dance hall artist. Like, bro, you just want attention. Uh, all he just want is want is for some tension. For all that other shit I can't mention. Because he got daddy issues for days and days and days. I'm sorry, it, it, it needed to get out, but but anyways, Drake, I like your old music, but your new music, it just doesn't hit the same. It doesn't hit the same at all, Drake. You need to go to therapy before you get killed out here or you get jumped. Okay, because these hairstyles, they ain't it, brother. You need to figure it out, okay? And then come back with this new brand and figure it out for yourself. Rap about succeeding, drinking, partying like you used to. Stop singing about lost love. It's annoying. Anyways. That's all I have to say. I will see you guys after the game, probably. It might take a while, but I will most definitely be back. You know what I'm saying? Thank you guys so much for watching this video. And I will see you guys on the next one, as always.